Hello everyone. In this video, I am going to show you how we will install Apache Kafka in uh, Docker environment. So I am not going to install in my Mac OS. So in my previous video, I just installed my uh, I just installed Kafka in my Mac OS. Right now, we are going to another approach where we are using some images from uh, some of the GitHub repositories. It include Kafka and Zookeeper, and we are going to use that images to create a Docker container of Apache Kafka. So how we will do that? So right now I'm just going to my one of my folder that I create in my system. So it's called Tools Docker. So right now nothing is there. So I am going to uh, take this particular repository from GitHub. So it's an open repository. And right now it's cloning. I got everything. And inside that I have inside that I have a folder called Kafka Docker. So I am inside that one. So what I need to do is I need to change something here. I guess I don't need to change anything. No, I need to have a Docker Compose file here. Let's see whether I have that one. LS Docker Compose. Yeah, I have Docker Compose YAML. So if you are going here, you can see what are the things. Say that Docker Compose file. So okay. So it's asking for my password right now. Okay, I can see everything here. So version two. Uh, the image name and port and uh, any, uh, I have two services one is zookeeper the image and port then the other one Kafka build port 9092 Kafka edit is host name Kafka zookeeper connect also there so these are the things that I have let's see whether it will work so I am um, outside my Docker Compass file. So right now I need to make it up. So I'm just running this command. Probably it's enough to creating everything that we need. So right now it's downloading all the Docker files. Let's see what is going to happen right now. Okay, so it's just going to complete. So wait for that one. Then we'll do something else. So yeah, everything is going to be fine right now. I'm not getting any errors. Scale the cluster um, by adding more brokers. We'll start a single zookeeper instance. Okay, everything is done right now. 
if you, I am going here to PS minus A, I can see whether it's yeah, this view is okay. So here MongoDB is exited and had to three days ago. That's uh, that's good. I have no worry about that one. So I am worry only about Zookeeper and Kafka. So it's up right now. So I know what I, I need to do is I need to scale this one. So I'm just set, setting that one. Setting Kafka Docker, Kafka one, Docker Kafka two. So what exactly happening here? I have three more images of Kafka. So both are in 9092, but it is scaling into two, three different instances. So that's where we can scale. So that already I did. You can check the process running it. 10, 10. Start Kafka shell dot as such. Docker host IP Kafka to test host name. So we need to provide that one. Probably this address. I need to provide this one. Then I can access the search. Probably I, I will make it in my Uh, so first I need to find my docker host IP which toolbox I don't know how I will get them, so I need to get them. So, Docker machine IP default. I guess this will give my IP address. Let's see. Okay, so that I will do in next video.